hello and welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how i made this walking stick using just hand tools let's get started this is a piece of stock i'm going to use for the dowel the other piece of mahogany for the handle i start by planing one of the edge flat and straight so that I can run a marking gaze along it. Rip this piece apart and plane the other three surfaces to give me a 1 inch by 1 inch stock. To make the handle, I use a template which I paste on the piece. Once I cut this piece, I plane the bottom surface square to the face because this surface will receive the stick or dowel. Next I find the center where I will bore a hole. I use the drill machine which is the only power tool as I do not have any boring tools. I could have used a chisel but it's easier to use a drill. I drilled a 2 inches deep hole by using a half inch drill bit. I squared the hole as I planned to uh, use a tenon instead of a dowel. I marked the tenon on the long piece. I checked my dovetail saw which will be able to reach nearly the depth required.
So I created a knife wall for the swinger of the tenant and I saw it using a crosscut saw. After a bit of cleanup, the tannin is ready for the mortise. Next job is to make the stick round. To do this, I clean the corners to get an octagon and then blend the sharp edges to look round. Some sharp edges may be there which will disappear after sanding. I won't mind leaving some hand tool marks which looks better. For the handle I remove bulk of the waste by sawing. To shape this curve, I create some relief cut and chisel most of the waste.
In order to get the curved dropper, I use several other tools like a file, sandpaper wrapped on a half round dowel and even a spoke shave, whichever tool was able to get into the curve. Once this basic shape is ready, I drew some pencil lines quarter inch away from the edge using a finger gauge. This will guide me to make the round over. Using a chisel, I remove the corners to the pencil line, being aware of the green direction. I have made the rough shaping except near the mortise which I will blend after gluing the stick. Next I need to smoothen the rounds using some coarse sandpaper. A rasp would be fine in this case. Basically we need to remove the sharp edges left by the chisel. After gluing, I shape the leftover portion. As I shape the handle with the coarse sandpaper, it's time to remove these marks by using a 220 grit sandpaper. Walking sticks need some grip at the bottom, so I decided to fix this piece of rubber. I countersink it to, to receive the head of the screw.
remove the excess with a knife and fix it with glue. Using a sandpaper, I blended it with the stick. Finally, it's time to apply some finish. For this, I use shellac. After applying 4 coats of shellac, the stick is ready for use. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe for more videos.